Hello, this is Ahmed Kayyum. If you want to make use of digital camouflage pattern in your designs, such as stickers, military textile backgrounds, and you do not know how to create, so I'm here to guide you for creating these camouflage patterns in Adobe Illustrator. So you can easily create in sim few simple steps in just five to 10 minutes. So let's get started with it. Just go to file and create a new one so let's name it as digital pattern so i'm giving it a size 1000 points by 1000 points and let's create the file so i just want to copy this image so that i can copy the colors from this image i can make use of the colors just paste by hitting ctrl v from your keyboard so there are approximately four to five colors uh, used in every single pattern. So in this pattern, there are four colors. So let's create four small boxes. And we can just copy the colors by using eyedropper to these scales. Click on the first one, select eyedropper, and let's copy this dark green. Let's copy this almost very near to black. Let's copy this light green. Okay. And the last one is the brown color. Okay. So yeah, we have copied the colors and now we will create the pattern to the left side of your screen you can see this toolbox and by default you will see this line segment tool so just click and hold so you will see this pop-up menu there you can select rectangular grid tool just select and now double click on it so there you can see the options for the rectangular grid tool uh, you can change the dividers the the number of dividers so I'm just uh, setting it as 30 or you can just reduce so let's make it 20 vertical dividers it's 20 and horizontal dividers so there are 20 just click OK and let's create a rectangular grid tool okay so to make it visible just select and assign it a border now go to the pathfinder and if you cannot see the pathfinder on your right side just go to windows and there you can see pathfinder so just click here divide and ungroup all these boxes so now you can see that this one is a separate box this is a separate one so this one is a separate one okay so now we just have to assign colors to these boxes so that we can create a similar pattern so for this specific purpose let's make it a little big so go to windows go to windows and open swatches so here just create a new color group and name it as military swatches so now we have to make use of these colors so for this specific purpose, what we can do is, so by default, you will see this shape builder tool. So just click and hold and select this live paint bucket. So select all, go to paint bucket and just use your keyboard arrows and go to this color group. So now, 
so now i can uh, assign colors to these boxes so let's get started and now you will get to know that how i gonna create this pattern So yeah, now I, I have filled all the boxes. So now what we can do is we just have to select all and we just have to make this stroke none. And now you can see the pattern we have created so far. So the next big thing is because we want to create a pattern. So and we want to create a seamless pattern. So for that specific purpose, what we have to do is just make a copy of it and let's let's make it a group so hit command g or control g from your keyboard and let's make it a make it a copy of it let's make another copy let's make another and let's make another copy So if you see a kind of a partition, so there you can see that I can see a line here and I see a line here as well. So I want to make it a seamless pattern. So there you can see a very clear line is visible at the bottom and a very clear line is visible on the top. So on the left and right, yeah, it seems, it seems good. So now what we have to do, we have to we have to make this pattern a seamless one so for that specific purpose what we can do is let's go again to the live bucket and go to the swatches okay so what we can do is we we can match the colors so for that specific purpose go to brown and let's make it brown and for the black let's make this one a little black let's make a copy of it because we have made changes to this box and this is gonna repeat so I think it it seems better so let's remove this one as well and let's repeat this and now it seems good to me as well so yeah now this is the final uh, design we are going to make a pattern from it so select this make a group and go to object pattern and make a new pattern so let me make it as this and just click done now you can apply that pattern on any shape that you want to create so just i have just created a shape and this is what we have created so far so select this shape and click on your pattern you have created so this is how you can uh, create patterns. So still you can see some solid lines. So, so to avoid these such kind of sorted lines, what we can do is we can make use of Now it seems more seamless as compared to this one. Now you can select this and now you can make pattern out of this whole group. So this is how you can make a digital camouflage pattern in Adobe Illustrator. I hope you like the video. See you in the next one. Thank you so much.